your work experience is not going to be the same as everybody else's. Let me explain this. All right, y'all guys. All right, man. This is Josh back at it with another body game video. Make sure y'all subscribe too if y'all haven't enjoyed my content because most of y'all are returning folks. So if you have been enjoying my content, seeing other of my content, subscribe because I'm going to have more bangers. You know what I'm saying? I have a lot of things to tell y'all. Like I have a lot of information, a lot of game to tell y'all on body game. But for today's video, we are going to talk about body game in the workplace. All right, yes, but yes, I'm back with another video, man. Make sure you guys follow the Discord also. I need to have a community to where you guys can communicate. We can communicate with each other and everything like that. So I was like, yeah, let me make a Discord. You guys can follow my Discord. It's in the description. Make sure you follow. Make sure you like the video to subscribe, as I was saying. That <laughs> your work experience is not going to be the same as everybody else's. Let me explain this. When you are practicing body game, when you have a crazy physique, like um, shout out to the guy. One of the guys was DMing me. On, um, on the, in the community, right? He had a crazy physique and he was a little bit younger. So I don't know if he actually knows this, but you get treated differently when you are strong. You know what I'm saying? When you're strong, when you're masculine, you have that V taper, you know, wide back, slim waist. Man, I'm telling you guys, it's literally, I did sales. You, your sales are a lot easier if you are in sales, if you're trying to make money. Uh, if you do real estate, real estate is a lot easier for you, especially too if you're attractive. You know, say you have a nice style. But body game in the workplace is great and all. Like, there's so many pros to it. It outweighs the negatives, like the cons. But one thing with the pros is that people are watching you like a hawk. Like, you will be watched on cameras. You will be interrupted from conversations. You will literally not be able to talk to somebody for too long before somebody says that you're attracted to them there'll be a lot of rumors you know what i'm saying you cannot do anything <laughs> you can do anything at your do what you want you know what I'm saying have discretion but understand that nothing is going to be private so you have to be mindful on that you definitely want to be professional because that is your name attached to it but Man, people are going to watch you like a hawk. And I say that if you are working, if you're younger, you're working where you're, if you're working your way up, like, you know what I'm saying, you're starting at an entry level position, man, you are going to get a lot of attention from women. You're going to get a lot of attention from, from like guys, from higher ups trying to, you know what I'm saying, little bro you pretty much. And it's just, it's the beauty of it. You know what I mean? As you get older, you start recognizing that it's really like a gift. And it's like, uh, you should be grateful that you had these type of opportunities. But your job is going to be a lot harder for you because you have to understand that when you work somewhere, you spend majority of your life at that job. You know what I mean? It's almost like school again, but just that you're not learning. It's just all about like social interaction, you know what I'm saying? making money and everything. But when you're practicing body game, you will notice that people are drawn to you in a sense so they don't know if they hate you they don't know if they like you. they're just all out confused they don't know if they want to be your friend they don't know if they want to work out with you they don't know if they're attracted to you and it's just like you get all types of energies from everybody and then also too you will notice that people will notice your aura you know what I'm saying they'll notice your energy and they will want that type of same energy as well so you'll notice that when you're practicing body game you're able to stand alone and people will come to you. You know what I'm saying? People will be attracted by how you carry yourself, how your body looks, how you act, your your style, your physique. You know what I'm saying? If you play sports, you guys know. But it's just like you're almost like an athlete in a workplace. So it's like you stand out so much. And the experience is like no other because the problems arise because people start to watch you so much that they become, it starts from admiration to envy police you you know what i mean they the job the their job becomes okay what are you doing how productive are you what do you have going on and it's just like the attention is so great and that's what you have to understand with body game you get so much attention whether if it's negative or positive it's so great that a person literally dedicates their life to figure out what you're doing and how you're doing it that they forget about the other associates they forget about the other people who work there because it's just that your energy is so strong and it's like the way you live your life working out and have a nice body it attracts them and it's just like they can't they can't they can't stop it. it's a continuous process and then you know what i mean when you have muscles muscles just don't go away like that so 
it's going to be an everyday thing, especially if you are hitting the gym still. Man, <laughs> I'm going to have more videos about that with women and stuff like that. So make sure you turn on the like button. Make sure you subscribe. But it's just that you just have so much aura in this place, this workplace. No matter what country you're in, too. It's just like you have so much aura and you have so many different age groups. And it's just that people are just amazed about how you carry yourself you know what i'm saying because you think about it, if you are younger it's, it's no pro i mean there's no conscious if you are younger you are working on yourself you're motivational to people because it's just like okay man this guy's on his grind he's working he's, he's getting to the check getting to the bag and he looks good he's working on his body he's working on himself and it's just like people kind of think of like dang i wish i if i had an opportunity i would be the same way and i was kind of like that too when i started to see like the younger 17 18 year old guys now I'm like, dang, man, like they really, you know what I'm saying? They're really putting their foot, putting their groundwork in, like getting the work in to get ahead. I'm like, dang, man, it reminds me of myself kind of like I kind of be doing that. And I'm not as old, but it's just kind of like, dang, you kind of be like this person really, this person really on their grind. You know what I'm saying? But I don't do it in the hating way. But you would notice people will kind of be envious of you and hate you if you are younger and succeeding. And then, too, like if you are older, it's just like people are motivated, too, because you may not look like your other age group, uh, uh, your other counterparts, like your other people who are close to your age. I know a guy uh, commented out on my video who's like he's a little bit older, but he just doesn't look like his age. You know what I'm saying? It's just like people you tell them the age and it's like they don't believe you or if, when they do is they don't care. They're like, all right, bro, like. This is what I like. I'm going to talk to you. You know what I'm saying? This is I'm attracted to. You. They start dating, everything like that. Like a lot of people who are older, they just because they work on themselves so much, their body just does not add up to their age. You know what I mean? So that's another pro to it. But you got to understand, too, when somebody's interacting with you. They may not be used to that type of energy. They may not be used to somebody working on their body. They may not be used to somebody with that level of physique. And you will feel that energy. It's a lot of pressure, too, because people are looking forward to you showing up. People, you brighten their day, their, their day. They're looking for you to either spread wisdom or just, like, show your personality, make them laugh. It's like, it's a lot of pressure. It's just like, bro, I'm just a regular guy. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm just a regular dude just trying to work and make a living. But it's almost as if you're on a reality TV show, bro. It's almost as if... Every move that you make is documented. Every mistake that you make is literally highlighted and plastered. That's another thing. But it's, it's just also, too, like, to look at it, it's more of a blessing because not everybody has that mindset. You know what I'm saying? And being in America, it's just like a lot of people are not in shape. And a lot of people who are in shape don't really have that money to back it up. So when you have both, oh, yeah, it's just like a, a wow factor. Like, it's almost like you just you're off the charts, but you know what I'm saying? Also just kind of be careful with it because when you are working out and you are going to work, you become a hot commodity, man. Like <laughs> you become a hot commodity. Um, you know what I'm saying? If you are dating or you are in a relationship, your partner knows this, you know what I'm saying? Your boyfriend knows this, your girlfriend knows this. They know like <laughs> if your body is banging, somebody is going to be trying to get at you. You know what I'm saying? No matter if you marry or not, it doesn't stop. You know what I mean? It does not. So whether if you're married or the other person's married, people don't care. You know what I'm saying? People are just attracted to what they're attracted to. And it's kind of like how it works. But just kind of be understanding that, like, <laughs> the body game power is not something to be played with. It's a whole underworld with that man. Shout out to Ron Wills. But it's just a whole nother aspect of how somebody approaches you on body game. And that approach does not stop at work. And tell you that approach does not stop at work that does not stop anybody body game if anything it makes it stronger that their, their approach is going to be a lot stronger as you're going to be looking around like are we at work you know what I'm saying? are we at, did anybody hear that you know are you comfortable with listen it is something that should be studied i don't know if that that should be a movie you know what i mean like i'm pretty sure people know about it but it's more so swept under the rug of how it works but just understand when you're a practicing body game and you are in the workplace, you disrupt the hierarchy. You know what I'm saying? You you dismantle it. You don't become, um, you know what I'm saying? You're not at the bottom. You know what I'm saying? You're not entry level. You're not hot. It's just like you're in a lane of itself. You know what I'm saying? But it just causes a lot of attention. And I want you guys to understand that. I will have more videos on this. If you do like these type videos, make sure you like because I can make videos on these type topics so I can further explain. 
But if you do have experiences like that, put it in the comment box below. Like, tell me, bro, if you have experience, bro. Please tell me I ain't the only one. Like, please comment down below if you have any experiences. Ask me any questions down below, and I'll see you in my next video. I'm out.